everyone. Welcome back. It's a 52 degree morning here in Louisiana. I'm going to head out to the spot where I would usually do the catfish lines off the bridge. And if there's not a ton of people there, I think it's time to throw a line in and we'll fish for a while. See if we can't catch a catfish. Well, today for bait, I brought uh, some of my snack sticks <laughs> because everybody says that they uh, seem to bite on hot dogs. I have some boiled shrimp that were left over and I just caught some uh, mud bugs. We have those for bait as well. Well, I'm just gonna get everything set up here and I'm gonna throw the line in the water. Looks like we have people coming down here that might be doing some fishing also. Lucky I got my favorite spot. I have two lines in now, the one with the uh, crawfish on it, it already stole the bait. The fish jumped and the bait was gone, so I just switched it out with a circle hook and put another one on. And the other one that I have over kind of by the bridge, that one has a piece of the snack stick on it. I put one more line in here, just a string with a hook on it, and that one has some boiled shrimp on there. Okay everyone, well, I don't know, uh, <laughs> it's not a catfish, but uh, the guys that are over there fishing, they told me how to cook this. He said it's good, it looks like a fish that you throw back, but we're going to try it. Okay everyone, while I left there, uh, people were coming in by the car loads now, and I, I like to fish, but I like to fish fairly alone, not with people right next to me. And I looked up on that fish, and that fish was called a bowfin. I don't know what they called it, I never heard that name before, but uh, anyway, he told me how you cook it, where you have to boil the meats, and the bones fall to the bottom, and the meat comes to the top, and you scoop off the meat and you mix it up with like instant mashed potatoes and breadcrumbs and seasoning and then you fry it into patties and that really is that's just too much work I'm not gonna go through that so I went over there and asked those guys and they wanted the fish so everybody's happy thanks a lot for watching everybody except for the driving part of this video everything else was done with the DSLR the new camera so I'll be interesting to see how clear that turned out
I'll see you guys on the next video.